The carnival atmosphere, the smell of brides and proiki guys training out in the parking lot. Clearly, spring has sprung and few are embracing the change of season as much as builders. It is a very exciting time for them and for us as our attention turns to the beautiful outdoors. And they are also using the opportunity to embrace their community in a whole different way. I think it's time to get in on the action. A new season means new adventures, and Graham joined in the celebrations at the Builder Spring Carnival. The seasons have finally changed, and your customers are embracing the change of season and embracing your little spring carnival here. Take me through today's activities. It's always nice to celebrate spring. It's a new season, it's colorful, and we know it's breaking of summer. So we have a nice poikikos competition out here. The food will be donated to the local school's feeding scheme. We like to be involved in our community. And then Mega Master has donated a nice braai as a prize for us for the Poikikos competition. Now, just looking at the way that you engage with your customers, clearly you have a very strong connection with your community. Why is it so important for you to do these sorts of events, to connect in this way? Our community is our customers and they support the local hardware store. So we always try to give back to the local community and this is our way of trying and giving back to our local customers and community. Well, really exciting to move into a new sales phase as well as the season breaks in. What are the big ticket items? Pool, patio and braai, but mostly your garden plants, which is for summer. And this is what we've got outside here today. Talk about embracing new beginnings. The next stop in our spring celebration takes us to Centurion, where a brand new Builders Express has just opened. And I can tell you, there is a line of cars going around the block. I'm guessing we're about to meet a very proud new manager. Let's go. The new store boasts an impressive trading area of more than 1,800 square meters, plus an impressive garden center with lots of free parking. Mungwe Mamarekhan is at the helm of this new shopping destination. First of all, sir, congratulations on your shining brand new store. Um, I can see the community here has really embraced it. There's literally a line of cars going around the block. How have the first few days been? The three days have been awesome. Well beyond our expectation, we have received uh, overwhelming support from this community. And you really do seem to be achieving that, so well done. What has amazed me as well is, is seeing the cross-section, the diversity of your customers. I'm guessing that's a plan as well. Take me through how you designed the store and what your intentions were with the layout of the products, etc. It's a hardware store to start with, okay? But we'd like to think more about that as well, given that we sell more things other than hardware that a man would actually go into a hardware and pick up. We have cushions, okay? We also threw in a nursery, something that a lady would come into a store and have a, a comfortable feel when they walk our stores. But it's a feeling that we'd like to create, that it's a family store. What can a consumer expect from your particular store? Respect and customer service. And not only customer service, the best customer service. Graham's third spring stop took him to one of the flagship stores in Centurion. Paul, clearly you guys are embracing the new season. What are you doing to prepare for spring in store? I think the whole thing is about energy and excitement. We just want to get that through to our customers that we're as excited about the new season as what they should be. Our focus is on a lot of outdoor type of stock. We want to get the guys outside thinking about brying, getting their grass ready because they want to be proud of being out in their gardens. And we want them to feel special when they come to the store. You know, we've been at three stores today and have experienced that same culture in every store. Obviously, you guys have been well established. You've got a great bond with your community already. How do you create that? How do you form those bonds with the guys that really are your lifeblood? I think even though you work in the organization, you're still a customer at heart. So, you know, we look at things through the eyes of the customer and we just try and understand what would excite me if I went into a store. And if we can try and translate that onto the ground, then I think we can answer a lot of the questions that the customers may have. And hopefully that'll translate into just a great experience for them as well. How about celebrating the new season with a new project of your own? Keep in mind that you can find great DIY ideas on the Expresso website. Oh, clearly it's time for me to get to work, getting the pool ready and getting the mates over. And at least I know there is just one stop to get absolutely all the supplies I need. Builders, thank you so much for getting me inspired for summer.